What's up everybody, we're back with another video and as you see from the title, uh, we're going to be talking about the uh, new PS5 revision. Um, looks like the rumors were true. So um, pretty much going to be looking at the PlayStation blog and um, taking a quick look at uh, the system, uh, changes that they made and uh, I guess the differences between the newer one coming uh, this November and the old one. So, let's jump right over to the page and see what it's looking like. Okay, so all this released on the 10th of October. I'll probably have this up the next day, so probably by the 11th. Um, but yeah, this is the new uh, revision for the P PS5. Um, it's slimmer. I think it's like 30% slimmer. We'll go, go down here real quick. Uh... As the holiday season approaches, we are excited to share that we have a new PS5 model launching. To address the evolving needs of players, our engineering and design teams collaborated on a new form factor that provides greater choice and flexibility. Same technology features that make PS5 the best to play are packed into a smaller form factor, along with an attachable Ultra HD Blu-ray disk drive and a 1TB SSD for more internal storage. So yeah, this is the new look of it. it basically looks the same, but uh, it's got these slits in it. And I believe each one of these are different uh, panels that can be taken off and uh, put back on. So the new PS5 has been reduced in volume by more than 30% and weight by 18% and 24% compared to the previous models. Uh, there are four separate cover panels. Yeah, like I was saying, four separate cover panels with the top portion in a glossy look while the bottom remains in matte. Uh, I don't really know how, they, how I feel about a glossy look, especially if you got different colors. Probably, uh, I like everything to stay matte. But uh, if you purchase the PS5 Digital Edition, you can add the Ultra HD Blu-ray drive, a disc drive for PS5 later, as it will also be sold separately for $79.99 USD um 119 euros 99 gpb and 11,980 yen um with that 80 dollars how much is it um as this is the disk drive and they show you how you can put it on I mean, that's pretty cool. The fact that you can just put it in, take it on and off, and it just attached so you can be able to uh, go digital and uh, physical. Uh, the new PS5 model will be available starting this November in the US, in the US and select local retailers and direct PlayStation.com where available. So in November, it's only going to be available in the U.S. and certain stores and PlayStation Direct. Uh, we'll continue to roll out globally in the following months once inventory of the current PS5 model has sold out. The new PS5 will become the only model available. Yeah, so they're working on uh, selling off all the old PS5 models. So after all those sell out, you won't be able to get the original ones anymore and uh, I guess we could play a little video Hold on. Sure. Uh, I gotta put the uh... yeah, there we go load this up and let it play uh, that was it. Okay, um, recommended retail price for the new PS5 model are 
as follows beginning with the rollout in November of anticipating retailers. So US PS5 with the Ultra HD Blu-ray disc drive uh, $499.99 so basically the same price as the uh, disc drive PS5 now. Uh, PS5 Digital Edition uh, $449.99 so they're actually taking the price up uh, 50 bucks. Um, the one now the digital is $400 so now they're uh, I guess taking the chance to um, bump up the price which sucks I ain't really cool with that so with that being the case you may as well buy the um, the one that comes with the disk drive because if you're gonna pay for it separately it's $80 so instead you'll be paying um but uh 520 no 530 yeah 530 so i mean if, if you're gonna wait or if you want to get this one you may as well get with disk drive there's no point in paying that extra money uh europe especially if you live in uh, certain other places yeah you may as well buy buy go with the disk drive even if you're gonna play with all digital um, go with the disk drive um, that's what I would suggest especially because a lot of times you can you can find physical games pretty cheap whether you go with use or like uh, this week um, GameStop had a big sale I think Amazon has a sale um, Best Buy has sales. Um, for instance, Callisto Protocol, I got it for five dollars at uh, GameStop. So I would suggest going with a uh, uh, disk drive. But I mean, hey. Um, okay, and the horizontal stand will be included with the new PS5 model. Also, new vertical stand compatible with all PS5 models will be sold separately for thirty dollars. 2999 USD uh, same with euros GPB what is that 25 and 3980 yen and even with this see the original PS5 comes with a vertical stand so now you don't even get that in the box so you got to pay $30 to actually get the vertical stand for the uh, system so they're um, it's cool that you can add on a disk drive, but you're getting less in the box. Um, but I guess one thing that is different is you're getting uh, one terabyte instead of, I think it was like um, 600 something gigs um, of internal storage that you could actually use. So you're getting, you're getting a little bit more as far as internal storage, but um now you actually have to pay for the vertical stand and this is the horizontal stand the heck? so I don't know if that's like already built in or if it's um something in the box that you just hook on to that just seems like a small piece of metal or something I don't know um also they talked about some uh we got some um new covers a variety of PS5 console covers cover colors but a new model will be available starting in early 2024 including an all matte all matte black uh colorway and a deep earth collection Colors in volcanic red, cobalt blue, and sterling silver. Prices for the PS5 console covers will be $54.99 USD, Euros, GPB, $44.99 GPB, 7,480 yen. Additional colors will be released in the future. Um, this is talking about some games coming for the holiday season. But, uh, yeah. Oh, they got all the specifications and everything. Um, I guess height, weight, depth. All of it's pretty much the same, I guess, except for the um, 
like dimensions and everything. But everything else is the same except for the SSD. You get the one terabyte. And um, everything else is pretty much the same. But yeah. Um, I mean, it's cool. A little bit smaller than the um, original PS5. Um, it's cool you can add a disk drive, but I really don't see why you would buy the digital and just not um, spend fifty dollars more to get a disk drive. Um, I could see somewhat. For me personally, I always wanted a disk drive if they had it, but I could see somewhat with the uh, original ones that came out since it was a hundred dollars cheaper. But now it's like with just the fifty. May as well just say that get the one disk drive because if you for whatever reason decide you want it you didn't have to spend eighty dollars for it so i don't i really don't see what the point of even buying the digital one but some there's some people might want it but uh yeah that's gonna be it for the video um like i said the rumors were true with it um so I know the rumor was before with like the PlayStation Portable, a uh, portal, and like the earbuds and all that. That was true. The um, revision for the PS5, that's true. So it's most likely that we we'll probably will see a PS5 Pro. Uh, probably see PS5 Pro next year sometime. Um, these, there's no point in me buying this. Uh, only reason it would to do a video and just to look at it but uh, I don't see need not for me doing that not at the moment um, but if, if a PS5 Pro uh, probably would buy that um, and PlayStation Portal I got that reserved as well so we'll do a video on that next next month um, but that is it uh, it's gonna be it for the video so if you enjoyed it make sure you like share and subscribe hit the bell for notifications every time i go live and post a video leave a comment down below as well let me know if you're going to get the uh, new revision for the ps5 let me know if you already have a ps5 or if you're waiting to see this um see a revision and decide on that one um again like i said i i would go with uh the disc version if i didn't have one but uh, again, it's your choice. Let me know which one you pick. But that's it. Everyone have a good one. Be cool. Stay safe out there. Show someone some love. And God bless. Peace.